Are you folks ready to see a live Lumberjack show? This guy started log rolling when he was just three years old. Direct from Hayward, Wisconsin, Mr. Robert Cheer. What we're doing uh, inherently is dangerous because we're dealing with uh, very sharp tools and uh, we're racing on top of it. We make it look easy because we do it every day. And uh, by doing it every day, it becomes instinctive. And uh, hopefully the out end of that is we're good at it and it looks easy. This guy is an incredible all-around competitor, an incredible chopper, sawyer, speed climber, and log grower. Here he is from Missoula, Montana, Mr. Tony Bush. Out of all the uh, events we have here at uh, Iron Jack and all of Lumberjack Sports, pole climbing is considered to be the da most dangerous because there's so many variables involved. Uh, you've, got, you've got the height of the tree, your equipment, uh, lack of focus. Just anything can happen because it's all about speed. You're at 50, 60, 70, 80, 90 feet in the air and then just letting it go once you hit and a lot of stuff can happen at 90 feet. Log rolling is probably the most difficult part of our sport to learn. It, it takes incredible skill. Well, you can only learn it on your own. You can't be taught how to log roll. You have to, you actually have to spend the time doing it. You have to spend literally hundreds, maybe even thousands of hours log rolling before you're actually going to get it. To be a good axeman, it's not just about being able to take a razor sharp axe and hit it into the wood. Chopper is ready. You have to be able to know exactly where to place that 21 thousandths of an inch, which is your leading edge, every time you hit the block. If that's not in the right place, you're not going to be a good axeman. So it's really a, an axeman develops over years. It usually takes about oh, three, four years to come into your own as an axeman. And some of your best axemen, if they start when they're in their teens, uh, become world champions in their 40s and 50s. So it's a it's really about skill as much as it is about being an effective athlete. Well, mine is a professional throwing axe. This is... No, don't, don't start talking about what my axe is because this is my axe and it's a matter of choice. It, uh, it finds a bullseye <laughs> every time it's thrown and everybody's jealous of my axe. A lot of this is about aesthetics. It finds bullseyes. I don't care if it's ugly or whatever. It, it finds bullseyes, and that's what it's about. Uh, it's not about looking good. It's about finding bullseyes. Lumberjack sports is really about tools and being an athlete. I'm Tony Bush. And I'm Robert Shear. And you're watching Over the Edge. Edge.